10 seconds 5 seconds start dear friends i am very happy to be with you all to discuss various subjects relating to the working class in our country while going through the agenda papers i have noticed that the industrial relations legislation is proposed to be modified completely to suit the needs of the labor and industry in this connection may i refer to one point for the consideration of this conference the term appropriate government under the industrial disputes act needs revision invariably in all the public sector undertakings under the control of the central government if any law and order situation arises the state as custodian of law and order is bound to intervene and maintain peace in industry at the same time they are not able to settle the disputes between the parties as they are not the appropriate government for that matter may i therefore suggest that this conference may consider the question of amending the industrial disputes act suitably to give the state governments the necessary statutory powers to settle industrial disputes in the central sector units situated in the states another important suggestion i would like to place before this conference is that in various labor legislations either for regulating the service conditions or for providing social security measures or welfare measures the provision on number of workmen for application of these laws has been the main obstacle in the effective implementation of these legislation for the benefit of workmen wherever such ceiling exists in labor legislations the employers resort to reduction of the number of workmen in their establishments to disown the obligations put on them this has been considered by us and we are of the opinion that the ceiling limit of workers in various beneficial labor legislations for their application should be removed so that the statutory benefits could be made available to all the workers in industrial establishments irrespective of the number of workers working in those establishments another aspect which i would like to place before this conference is the plight of the contract labor in this matter i wish to be frank that the implementation of this legislation is far from satisfactory i presume that the same situation prevails throughout india as the procedure for abolition of contract labor is rather complicated the problem is that the contract labor act does not provide for any relief to the workman thrown out of employment by the abolition of contract labor our state government have moved an amendment to this legislation to provide that in the event of abolition of contract labor the principal employers of such industrial establishments should be required to observe the affected workers in this legislation the ceiling on the number of workmen for coverage is another check for its effective enforcement of late it has become the practice of parties to dispute to take up cases before the high court questioning the orders of the government and the orders of the various authorities created under different labor laws this in turn has resulted in accumulation of writ petitions before the high courts the high courts in all the states have been overburdened with the number of writ petitions filled by the affected persons from different walks of life this conference may perhaps consider recommending to the government of india for the creation of special benches in the state high courts exclusively 
for dealing with writ petitions arising out of the labor matters this will benefit the employees in securing speedy justice these progressive measures are essential for the benefit of the workers and the weaker sections of the society letter from the manager chakrapani and company kumbagonam to the proprietor krishna traders chennai dear sir i am in receipt of your order for the supply of brass vessels to you for distribution to other local traders and for sales through your retail shop the number of vessels ordered under each item is a very large quantity and we will try to supply them as desired by you before the end of next month in this connection i would like to inform you that the quality metal sheets are in short supply therefore we are making arrangements to procure them from various sources to meet the seasonal demand and to keep the schedule of supply to our customers in fact we are sending our representative to visit personally the bulk suppliers of metal sheets in northern india to impress upon them the need to maintain timely supply and to ensure the dispatch of full quantity of ordered metal sheets we will be getting a clear picture about the supply soon after our representatives return from his trip meanwhile we are arranging to dispatch the available quantity of vessels to you so that you can manage the immediate requirements i would like to point out that your sum of rupees 50000 is still due from you for the supply we made last month i request you to kindly send this immediately without further delay and oblige thanking you you were faithfully